Welcome to another Photoshop tutorial from tutorvid.com. This tutorial is going to answer a question from Lasko Lover sent on YouTube and he asks, is there a quick way of batch converting a lot of JPEGs to a certain profile for sending to the lab for print? So to do this, I would use an action in Photoshop. So the first thing we have to do is create an action. To do that, I would open a single image in Photoshop and then all the steps we perform to this image will be repeated on the other images when we activate the action. So I'm gonna create a new action here with this button and then title the action send to printer for example and now everything we do here is going to be recorded and then we'll be able to be repeated on the future images so one thing printers want often is a certain color space so go up to edit convert to profile and then on this destination space pick your color space and there's tons here the most common ones are near the top for example adobe rgb or Profoto or sRGB is a popular one for printers. So pick the one you want and then press OK. And then another one could be the DPI. So go up to image, image size, and then make sure this resample image button is unchecked because you don't want to change the size of the image. You just want to change the resolution for printing. So if it's 300, type in 300 there and press OK and do whatever other changes you want to do to send to the printers. And the last thing is to save it. So go up to File, Save As. And now I have a special folder for saving images from an action, which is called Workbook. And it's just a temporary spot to save images. It's a good idea not to save over your original images. So you can keep your changes separate. And so choose your folder you want to save them in. And then file name, just leave that the same. And JPEG, if that's what you should use, save it as that. And click Save. I'll leave it at quality 12 since it's going to the printer and then OK. And then the last thing is close it with Control W. And then we're done our action so press the stop button and then head back to bridge and select the images you want to send to the printers and go up to tools, Photoshop and batch and then you'll have your batch options and default actions or whichever set your tutorial you just created is in and the action you want, send to printer, and then source, bridge, that's where we got them from, that's right. Destination, none, because we saved it in the action, we don't have to set to destination here. And then just press OK, and it'll rip through all the images and create the settings you wanted. If I head over to workbook, you can see them appearing here. And that's all you have to do. If you want to download an HD version of this tutorial or check out more tutorials, head over to tutorvid.com.